So, Linda, tell us about this car that you're selling today. This car happens to be one of my, my father's right. favorite uh, additions to our family. Right. And he bought this car in 1973 right. and gave it to my mom as a birthday gift. Wow. And my dad was a great collector of cars. His favorite car in the world were the, the Continentals from 1959 until right. this one here. Right. And uh, it's going to be... I'm having a bittersweet moment in time right now right, because this right. is something that was very special to my dad and my mother. So tell us about it. What what is it? What is it? What is the year make and model exactly? This is a uh, 1970 right. Lincoln Continental. Wow. Uh, Mark three. Mark three it is. And it looks to be pretty original. Original. My dad made sure it stayed in the garage, kept it clean, and clean as a whistle. So we were talking earlier, and you know what uh, precipitated you to sell this car. So what happened? What, what, why are you selling this car today? The reason I'm selling this car today is because I'm moving to Montana. Right. And I gotta get keep you know driving big trucks because I'm building our property and right. so we need, you know, this is a luxury car and I need something that's gonna get through mud and snow and put all my building material and this baby won't be able to do that. That, that's so. your, okay, so this was your dad's car, and I understand he passed away, and so it became part of his estate. Correct. And so we, we were able to help you out and and basically buy the car. Yes. So, so question, why did you sell your car to a dealer as opposed to selling it privately? Well, um, I've been driving down this street for many years, and I noticed... Uh, you know, the advertising, and I said, one day right. I gotta go in there and go look for a car myself. Right. And uh, the years just went along, and I decided, you know, this was a time because um, I have to close the estate, and this is one of the items left in the estate that I need to obviously release um, through circumstance. That's about the only reason, through moving out of state and closing the estate for my parents. Great, so, okay, so how did you find Dennis? Did Dennis buy his class of cars? Advertising on the street, driving by. Oh, driving, driving by. Driving by and looking at all the beautiful cars he has here and th thinking to myself, well, I'd love to have that one or maybe that one Great. when I'm just sitting in traffic. So that's what brought me here because I've just been driving by through. through well, time. thank you very much. We really appreciate it. Thank you, Dennis. And anything we can do in the future to help you out car-wise, let us know. You're, you're awesome. I really enjoyed our experience. Thank you so much. Thank you, Linda.